In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the ultimate team of the season, SBC, and also talking to you about if it is really worth it. So first of all, the ratings are an 83 rated squad with 75 chemistry, and you do need two team of the season players. You can't have three. I tried putting in three for the rating because I did have a spare one, but it didn't let me. So I did actually put player of the month, Kane. I just put all of these players in. I know I shouldn't really be putting, I could be really putting Robertson in. I mean, most people would, but I shouldn't really be putting in Fernandinho and Eriksen in form and mainly I shouldn't be putting in player of the month Harry Kane but I just did do it. it is the end of FIFA and you will actually see who I get very soon but you should most of you have two team of the season cards and I know most of you have liquidated your whole squads all of your club players just if you want you can go and pick up some players or you can just put in loads of players that are high rated and just put them around silver players from the same league because you still should have a few untradeable players and as we can see here ultimate team of the season player pack and in my opinion looking back at it now it's not really worth it too much I mean I, I am focusing on the World Cup mode probably like most of you and it's not really helping on there much at all the World Cup mode is actually going to finish so I know it feels like the end of FIFA but there still is going to be a few months on FIFA 18 ultimate team before FIFA 19 comes around as you can see here I get team of the season Kane and if you remember correctly I actually did put his player of the month version in so in my opinion this was 100% not worth it for me but obviously if you don't put in player of the month Kane which most of you won't and you don't get his team this season 95 rating then it will be a lot worth it for you so I definitely recommend this for you guys it is coming up close to the end of FIFA but if you still do play competitively with foot champions I'll definitely recommend you not to do this unless you have the coins to do so thank you guys for watching this video I'll see you tomorrow around the same time with another video